What's up everyone, I'm Captain Chubby and welcome back to Shadow of Mordor, episode 8. Now today, we advance to the new region. Let's press spacebar and start the mission, the messenger. We need to get some sort of messenger down, I guess. The Everybody's smell of dead. meat always attracts the scavengers. And they tend to travel in packs. Should oh, that music again. Queen will be pleased to see you. No oh, shit. Alright, let's go see your mum. <laughs> mm. What did you do yesterday? Nothing? Just visiting your mum? It's supposed to be funny. I think it's not though. So. We are here. Sorry about that. Oh, it looks nice. claims you have something for me. Not for you, Talia. Oh, thanks a lot. The hour grows late. Very soon, the Dark Lord and his army will march all over Mordor, but hmm. a great power can be awakened <gasps> to prevent it. Did you see that? Is that why I'm here? Breach into Morgoth's scar. Hmm. Take from the, the gold and craft work from Come the on, not the ghost. And find the dwarf. The dwarf? I shall find. The dwarf you shall find in the cave. Of ghouls. So strong. Mother. Yeah. Come. Time oh, takes it. Uh, it's tall. We're tall. No one knows. She worsened after her travels. Is it not medicine? There was. But our camp was overrun. Hmm. It looks like you have a plenty of medicine, like behind your back, but. I mean, I'm not a doctor, so don't mind me. There must be a better life than this. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Oh, the loading screen. What is nice though, that uh, you have like some dialogues in the loading screen that sometimes make sense. It's like interesting. Sometimes they don't, they just some words. <sighs> I need to find a way to Morgoth's Scar. There's a good chance we can pick up the ghoul's trail of that ransacked caravan we passed earlier by the ravine. Okay, I need to find the caravan. Now, uh, as I've mentioned before, I played this game until 25% was it? So I got a little, a little further than this, so I still know what's gonna be next. Kinda, yeah. All right, all right, all right. Fast travel. First spread through Sauron's land. Let's go His check out the caravan. Uh, uh, as you can uh, guess, I guess my guess is that you know that this region has absolutely new captains. Veteran captains, elite captains, and war chiefs. But we get something super nice in this uh, on this map, on this so region. Many dead I must thank the ghouls before I slaughter them. 
Ghouls are scavengers. They take all, but leave one thing behind. I must locate the ghouls' tracks. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's our the trail. tracks. I knew it. I knew the tracks gonna be there, so. Wait, what the hell? Where did they go? Oh. Okay. We're free. <laughs> yes, you are, guys. No, no problemo. Okay, we're gonna brutalize the guy so they run in fear. Oh, whoa, this guy is too brave. Okay, let's just uh, kill the guy. Okay, the tracks go down here, and uh, as you might have guessed, they will lead us into dark, this an unfriendly cave. Death. And this must be Morgoth's scum. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry for that. Oh, wow, well, I'm just gonna cut it out. The best and, move uh, is to remain unseen. Uh, if you wonder why there's like a, a jump cut, because I failed the previous run, because you need to move uh, unseen through the cave. And since I failed, I wanted to restart the mission. So, uh, yeah, I apologize for that. And uh, hopefully this time we can sneak it past. Ghouls fear fire as much as light. And Those flames uh, will prove useful if we are overwhelmed. There's the stuff. Another attack. And this cave will become what? a tomb. The hell? That was wrong? Okay, let's uh, open this room. Right here. Uh, as you noticed, there's like all those uh, runes through the mortar. And uh, yeah, as we collect them, the rune tree that you saw a second ago kind of opens the, uh, the rune wall that should display what it could have looked like if Saruman wouldn't come into this realm. I guess that's what it said. So, uh, yeah. Okay, this time I believe we can... Oh, why the fuck would you jump down? I'm here, come on. Oh, I need to... My bad. My bad. Sorry for that. Ah, yes! The mighty hammer! Yes, uh, indeed. Made by the Dark Lord himself. I'm still covered in my family's blood. Mm-hmm. Some uh, plot twist right there. <laughs> It looks ridiculous, like such a big guy and such a small hammer. We are oh, well. betrayed. Its power blazes like a beacon, and we will bring ruin to all in Earth. Mm -hmm. I wonder if that blonde girl was the uh, the I forgot the name, but if you remember the elf from Lord of the Rings one and two, and I think all of them? the one that met them in the uh, forbidden forest or something, and could see the future. That's a big goal. What is that creature? Okay, okay. Uh. 
Okay, my tactic is simple. We're gonna learn him down into this fire. Hopefully we can burn him down. What for? Oh, the fires. Okay, I got it, got it, got it. The fires. Is it? Is it the right way? Yeah, that's the right way. I hope it's the right way, because uh, if it's not. Oh shit! I missed the fire. Jump! No jump, a brick. No jump it is! Oh, I think we made it. Yeah. That was easy as well. Too bright. Ah, uh, oh, is this the bastard wolf? Pity to end your military career inside the belly of a ghoul, eh? Hmm. I'm Torvin, the beast hunter. The beast hunter. For ten pints, you just nabbed the treasure I was after. I bet you eleven I pints. I didn't. For the assistance. But it does not grant you proprietary rights. <laughs> Keep it! I just found something a lot more valuable. <laughs> and what would that be? My new hunting partner! Uh, what you hunt does not interest me, Master Dwarf. Even if it leads you to the chisel that belongs to that hammer. Hmm. Interesting. I would like to see the chisel that belongs to that hammer. Every creature's got its lure. Yours just happens to be uh, very old. Hmm. Well, if the thrill of the hunt takes your fancy, the camp's not far. Uh, all right, Master Dwarf. Thank you for the invite. Sorry, little dwarf. But first, we shall go back and uh, what of your vision? see our old lady. Kill a boo. I used all that he had taught me and forged the three in secret. Mm -hmm. Water, air, and fire. Alright. As you can see on the map right here, this is the dwarf mission. Big game. But we got something interesting. So we're gonna leave that for the later. And, uh, oh, my bad buddy. Oh, whoa. Sorry. Right, stop the mission. Accept. Yeah. Yeah, being old sucks, I guess. Thank you. You're welcome. I found the Mithril Hammer. Can your flames show me why my soul was denied death? Are those eyes black or you? 
You are the victim of a blood sacrifice. Can the curse be broken? Ah, oh, more tricks. And, and his followers. And claim Mordor. Sounds cheesy. No men of Gondor will come to my head. <laughs> 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 yeah. You don't need them. Your power begets followers, mm. willing or otherwise. Army. Do you see where this is going? How? How do I do this? Your answers are in the fortress nearby, but what you seek may not be there for much longer. Okay, I got that. I shall be on my way then. Yeah. Now, this right here is my... Marwin's decree was speed. The future must be met. Uh, so, the most exciting part, exciting part about this game for me was this. The thing we are doing right now, uh, in one word, I think it's one word, yeah. Um, it is mind control. Basically, we can control the orcs. We capture them using our rat power, uh, power of the wraiths, like our good old friend Calimbrimbor. He takes control of their minds and they follow us, help us fight. Eventually, we can capture the whole, uh, if you saw the Saruman's army, it can become Calibrimbor's army because we mind control them, we can send them on the missions. The side missions like power struggles and all that stuff becomes ours because let's say we send one of our guys to fight the other guy. Then we mind control the other guy as well and now we have two. You can mind control war chiefs as well. And, uh, I'm not sure how far it will take us, but so far I just got until this far. Like, I finished this mission, I know how it works, mind control, and I started capturing the war chiefs. I will save them nonetheless. Don't be blinded by your emotions. So, basically, this is the point of the game, almost a couple of minutes further. Our answers to building an orc army lie within this fortress. If we brand those archers, we can build our army and save these men at the same time. All right. Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah, you need to hold B to brand and shift plus C to stealth brand. But yeah, this is as far as I got. So yeah. Something just moved over there! No, nothing did move. Okay, as you can see we got one archer. Gondorians are invaders! Men are scourged! These villains are gaze into the light of my but eye. No See now the blue flames that will save you. And we take the he... as well! Okay, he didn't. The end of is too quick! No, no, no. No, no, fuck. <laughs> Alright, fine. Mine is the sight that will pierce your mortal will. How shall we make them bleed? Oh, move, 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 please. So, yeah, as you can see, we are mind controlling the archers. And, yeah, it's pretty easy if you're stealthy. There's a... There's a combat brand as well. Let your hand be guided by uh, silver. I believe you need to open the uh, talent for that. I mean, the ability point. And you can uh, mind control... You can mind control in combat. Uh, you need to hit the. You need to get the hit streak of eight, and uh, then you can mind control in combat. The guy starts fighting on your side right away. Okay, let's activate our guys. Eliminate fourteen enemies. Now the archers will help us to kill them. So all we do is we go down and finish off the rest. Yeah, 
Yeah, as you can see, the archers are shooting them. So. Oh, oh. Did they shoot me? Oh, don't shoot me. I'm on your side, you stupid archers. I just want the archers to finish them off. Alright, let's just... Oh, oh by the way, uh, I can hit my own guys still. The archers, I mean, so... It is possible. As you can see, the archers killed that guy on the right, and I finished this guy. Alright, good job. That was easy. Thank you for the assistance. The Lady of the Shore sent you to our aid. The Queen warned us to wait until the end of the battle. Then the orcs spotted I us. I told you, the visions always come to pass. Yes, but I told you not to. Do you have something for me? Uh, Queen Marwyn sent us to find this. Mm -hmm. Ah, more visions. That guy looked like Red Eye. It appears he already has the ring of power on his right arm, was it? So. still have our archers, so... Oh wait. I was dodging it. Oh wow. I was dodging it. They killed one archer, I think. Right, kill this guy, it works fine. Uh, the only problem is that I'm afraid that our archers might kill us as well, so... This is like my only concern, so that they don't shoot us. Barrel. I think we killed all of them. 
not sure why this kill move was there, but uh, yeah. Nice, we got them all. It is one thing to kill these Uruk, it is another to make them our followers. It is a gift. We can use the weapon of the enemy against Against us. All right. Uh, I believe I will have to finish this episode right here. But yeah, this is basically the most exciting part about this game, at least for me. The mind control, man. So far it's been awesome. When you get control, in control of the captains, when you get in control of the war chiefs, which are still not known to us, except this one guy for some reason. I'm not sure why, but we know him. But yeah. Then we get in control of the war chiefs and wow, it's like the game gets, I guess, the power struggles which are on the side become more interesting to finish and to fight through because you can help basically your own guy to advance in ranks and you gather your own army, so which is nice. You basically, uh, you can go into the fortress, mind control some works like brand them and then you start fighting and uh, yeah, you have like 10 more orcs fighting for you and not for them, which makes the game already a little interesting. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna finish right here, so thank you guys for watching, hope you guys enjoy it, and I hope you can, uh, you can stop by for the next episode, where we will be hunting war chiefs to make out them our friends, something like that. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, hope you guys enjoy it, and uh, leave a comment, a like, and hope to see you next time. Bye!